Hello, honey pie. Come away in and see who's at home today. Granny Murray's house has two at home to play. Granny Murray's house is home too. Who's here today? Well, we've got Hope and we've got Rachel, but don't just sit there, treasures. Come on, let's have some fun. What's Granny Murray got on her shelves today? This place is a bit of a mess, isn't it? I think we'll have a cleaning day today, girls. Two. We've got Hope and we've got Rachel, but someone's missing from home today. Oh, not anymore. Who's coming home to Granny Murray? Oh, it's Jack with Rudy. Hello there. <laughs> Rudy. Hi, Granny Murray. there and Jack come here. <laughs> yeah, ma'am. Oh, what's going on here then? Oh, we're having a bit of a cleaning day. You should get this lot a job with River Sea Fingal Cleansing Department. Who'd be in charge? Oh, Claude, your man. Why don't you all dress Claude up as a works foreman <gasps> and we'll make a clean getaway over here? <laughs> <laughs> I'll do the hat. <laughs> I like everything to be spick and span, Rudy. Oh, I, <laughs> yeah. oh, I couldn't agree more, Granny Murray. I hate it when there's rubbish everywhere and the noise it makes when you step on it. Oh, it crunch, slide, crunch, slide. <laughs> oh, there's a lots of litter in the market. Oh, people leave all sorts of food and stuff everywhere. It really gets in the way and oh, the smell. Oh, it won't help with my deal of the day. Oh, what's your deal of the day? Cups of fruit for a lunchtime snack. You know, tangerine pieces, grapes, strawberries, that sort of thing. One cup, one pound. Oh, sounds like a delicious bargain to me. <laughs> Claude's dressed. Oh. Claude, you look ready to clean River Sea Fingal. <laughs> and if he doesn't, we'll give him a tickle. <laughs> <laughs> That's for you. Oh, what's this? Wow. What do you want me to do with this? <laughs> Should I hang it out my pocket? No. No. Should I blow it my nose? No. Oh, no. <laughs> it's a duster, Rudy. Oh, fantastic. I'll take this to work with me. Yeah. Give us a cuddle. <laughs> <laughs> See you later, guys. <laughs> Come on now. Now remember, I do love everything to be spick and span. Thanks, Granny Murray. I'll see you later. I'll be thinking of you, darling. Oh, me too. Now, you keep a wee eye on Rudy and make sure he goes the right way to work. I'm on my way to work today. I'm walking me shoes through the city views. I'm stepping along and I'm swinging me arms and I'm singing my way through the city's charms. I get in there, it's just so fine. I so enjoy my walking time. I always go the way I know, but can you tell me the way I go? Hey! Okay, which way? And do I go left now? Or do I go right? Which way is wrong now? And which way is right? Right! Okay, that way, to the market. I'm on my way to work today. I'm going this way and that away. Hello, cobbles. Hello, train. Hello, roadworks. Hello, tram. Hello, sweeper. Hello, bag. Do I go down? Which way's a smile now? And which way's a frown? Ah! What, this way? You told me the way to go. Thank you, you showed me the way I know. Great, I've arrived. So what next? Oh yeah, I need to get changed into my work clothes. Oh dressed and ready to go. Oh, best get started with my deal of the day. 
Right, come on folks, roll up and get yourselves a fruit cup for just a pound. All the fruit is washed and ready to eat and popped in cups for a lovely treat. Hi Rudy. Oh, hello Bobby, how are you doing? Fine, thanks. I'm just up for a jog actually. And then I'm on my way to my gymnastics practice. Hey, what's all this? That's my deal of the day. Cups of fruit for just a pound. And they're packed with all the energy you'll need for your flips and flops and flaps and whatever else it is you do in gymnastics. <laughs> all right then. I'll take one. Actually, no. Make that two. I'll take one back for Kai for when he gets home from nursery. Oh, good idea, Bobby. There you go. Cheers, Bob. Fruits is us. Yay. <laughs> Give my love to Jack and Louie. All right, Bob. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh, I wonder how you're doing now, Jack. I love to skip in river sea thing, river sea thing, by the sea. I love to skip in river sea thing, river sea thing. getting on with your recycling. All done? Oh, I can hear the van. We'll need to hurry. I will take everything outside. That's us. Come on. What's it like at work, Daddy? Wow! <laughs> Look at these cups of fruit. Hi there, Louis. I had a great idea for your deal of the day. I've made some stickers for the cups. They say, Rudy's Fruit Cups with a smiley face. Fantastic. Oh, put them on. Hi, guys. Hi. Hey, Chuck. Can I interest you in one of my cups of fruit? Oh, they look great. I love fruit. Cool. Does that mean you don't mind helping me with the stickers? Oh, no. Ten cups of fruit on Rudy's Market Stall. Ten cups of fruit on Rudy's Market Stall. They look really tasty, I bet he sells them all Cos there's ten cups of fruit on Rudy's market stall <laughs> <laughs> But Chuck, what if someone buys one, like me? Here's a pound, Rudy Oh, thanks I'll have one too Whoa! <laughs> Eight, Eight cups, cups of fruit on Rudy's market stall <laughs> <laughs> Better split and get to the ferry, Chuck Catch you later, handsome. Oh. Bye. 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 Oh, I reckon I'm going to do a roaring trade with these fruit cups today. I better get down to some hard work. <laughs> and do be do be do. I make it look easy. What I do be do be do. And what I do is sell to you and you and you all of the veggies for a stew. But it's more than meets the eye. What I do for you as I buy and buy While you still sleep those fruit and veg to eat And the flowers in the early hours So when wake up comes It's there for you The market stalls are there to view the market, the market, what a wonderful place oh, The hub of the people, the smiles on each face oh, The market, the market, come look around oh, The hustle, the bustle, the bubbles of sound The colours all chaotic and spilling about The smells all exotic, yeah, the market cries out Objects to excite you and draw you near The buying and the selling Cheap or dear The market, the market I just love to be there The market is a wonderful place I've never sold so much fruit so quickly <laughs> Hiya Rudy, how's it going? Hey, hey Dr J <laughs> I've just finished work What's happened at the market? It's a bit of a tip round here. Is it? Well, well, that's what happens in the market towards the end of the day. People leave their litter everywhere. Well, I suppose. Oh, I've heard about your special deal of the day. Any cups of fruit left? Oh, just a few. I'm going to have to make some more. Here you go. That'll be a pound, please. Thank you. Here you are. Hey, I've got some great jokes my customers have told me this week. Did you hear about the boy who puts a clean pair of socks on every day? By the end of the week, he couldn't get his shoes on! <laughs> <laughs> oh, fantastic, Rudy! Oh, this cup of fruit is delicious! 
Right, I better get going. See you later. <laughs> See you later, Doc. Oh, Jack, I wonder what you're up to. I love to skip in River Sea Pinkle, River Sea Pinkle, that's for me. Are you glad we can make for some fish? You can't fix it. Oh, look at that. Quick, 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 quick. quick. Don't miss it. Can you see the boat? Now that is the boat that cleans the river. Oh, it's going underneath. Quick, everyone, other side. <laughs> oh, here it comes. Wow! Do you see that scoop on the top? Now that's what comes in and scoops all the rubbish off the top of the water. <gasps> Jack, I bet you can't wait to tell your dad about this. <laughs> Are you having fun, Daddy? This is just disgusting. Oh, oh, what have I trodden in? Oh, what a mess. Hello, Raymond. Are you, are you OK? Oh, I'm fine, Rudy, but the market is revolting. I have had to wait, simply wade through rubbish. But there's, there's muck just everywhere. Come on, it's, it's late in the day. Uh, you wouldn't find my boofy car in a mess like this whatever time of day you got on the train. Oh, do you think it's worse than usual then? Yes, it is. There's bits of squashed fruit, there's tangerine peel. What is this? Uh, Rudy's fruit cups? Rudy, I am shocked. Your stall has helped make the market into a rubbish tip. I'm going home now to scrub my but, shoes. But, oh no, how come I've been working hard all day and... The market's become an absolute tip. How did this happen? Where did the time go? At seven o'clock, I dropped off Jack at Granny Murray's. He helped dress Claude up as the boss of Riversea Fingal Cleaning Department because they were going to help Granny Murray clean her flat up today. She likes everything to be spick and span. At eight o'clock, I started to sell my deal of the day. Paper cups full of fruit as a tasty snack. Bobby jogged past. She was my first customer and she bought two cups of fruit, one for her and one for Kai for when he got home from nursery. At nine o'clock, Louie called by. She'd had a brilliant idea to put stickers on my cups of fruit. They said, Rudy's Fruit Cups and had a smiley face on them too. Chuck arrived and loved my cups of fruit idea too. Chuck sang a song about them and then they both bought one. So I decided I'd best make lots more. At three o'clock, Doc Juno passed by and said the market was looking messy, but she still bought a cup of fruit. At four o'clock, Raymond came to the stall. He was cross about all the rubbish in the market. He discovered that lots of the mess was made by my cups, with the Rudy's Fruit Cup stickers on. Now remember, I do love everything to be spick and span. I won't get any more customers with the market looking like a rubbish tip, as Granny Murray says, Everything needs to be spick and span. <laughs> so, it's a race against time. I've got to do it, I've got to do it. I've got to beat the clock before the chime. I've got to sort it, I've got to sort it. I've got to do the job on time. I like a busy bee, I'm gonna beat that bong. I'm gonna finish this job before I finish this song. Do we think he's gonna do it? Do the job that needs to be done. Will he know how to fix it? Will he finish what he has begun? I'm gonna do it. He's gonna do it. I'm gonna beat the clock before the chime. I'm gonna sort it. He's gonna start it. I'm gonna do the job on time. Like a busy bee, I'm gonna beat that bong. I'm gonna finish this job before I finish this song. Oh, the market's all spick and span now. <laughs> and I've got plenty more fruit cups to sell. So, Come on, folks, get your deal of the day. Rudy's fruit cups for just a pound. <laughs> I've heard all about these cups of fruit, so one for me, please, Rudy. <laughs> Hello there, Tina. That'll be a pound, please. Oh, thank you very much. <laughs> and the market looks so neat and tidy. Oh, and we would like to keep it that way, so if you wouldn't mind, rubbish in the bin when you're finished. <laughs> of course, Rudy. Oh, and give my love to Jack. <laughs> Will do. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh, I wonder what the kids are up to. A 
waste paper basket. What do we do with one of those? Put paper in! Put paper in! <laughs> That's the way! Look who's here, Jack! Give us a cuddle. Yeah! <laughs> Say thank you to Granny Murray. Thank you! Oh, come on! What a great boy! <laughs> and thank you from me too, Granny Murray. I remembered what you said. I do love everything to be spick and span. <laughs> and it saved the day. Oh, well, well. Come on, you two. You'll want to be off home. <laughs> come on, mate. Bye-bye, my darlings. I'm looking forward to next time. <laughs> me too. Come on, Jack. Let's talk about our time away. And I suppose you want me to tell you all about my time too? Well, there was hugging, squishing, walking, pushing, dancing, dusting, shooting, choosing, talking, cooking, drying, cleaning, saving, cleaning, loving, joking, losing things and rushing round, dressing up and sitting down. <sighs> but what was really special about today? Well, Claude was dressed as the foreman of River Sea Fingal Cleansing Department today. Because we were cleaning the flat, we were sweeping and dusting and scrubbing to make everything spick and span. Later, Jack had a go with the vacuum cleaner. He was amazed to see how much dirt the vacuum cleaner sucked off the floor. Then we sorted out the recycling into boxes ready for the bin lorry. A bit later, I took the children for a walk beside the River Fingal and we saw an amazing cleaning boat on the river. Here at home, we played Pass the Parcel. We made lots of mess with the paper, but then Jack unwrapped a rubbish bin so we could clean it all away. And in the end, Rudy made sure the market was spick and span too. I hope you enjoyed yourself. Me too. Bye-bye, honey pie. I, I love you.